good to see you. My name is Donald Roll. I am the older brother of Isaiah Roll, Iceman. And welcome to He Live, Heaven's Live Video Devotional. And the word on the street tonight is coming from Galatians chapter 5, verse 16. And so I want you to go there real quick as I read this very powerful and potent scripture. And it says, so I say, walk by the spirit and you will not gratify the desires of the sinful nature. For the sinful nature desires what is contrary to the spirit and the spirit what is contrary to the sinful nature. They are in conflict with each other so that you will not be able to do what you want. Wow. That's a powerful statement. And we are in part two of the Hulk within. The Bible just told us that there's a war going on within us. The flesh is fighting against the spirit. This whole battle begins when you become born again. When you give your life to Christ, when you become a new creature, when you accept him in your heart, as many of you have, all of a sudden something begins to creep in your life that begins to battle for the worship of God. And that's called the spirit of the Lord. The spirit of the Lord is moving you to worship. Problem is, is this. You have an old way of doing things. You have an old man or an old woman who's been living inside of you for years and they don't like change. And so now that the spirit is coming to do a new thing within you, man, your old nature is like, we'll, we'll start with all the change. And a fight ensues. It's sort of like the Hulk. The Hulk, he's always trying to figure out a, a concoction or some sort of remedy to deal with his problem of the incredible Hulk within him. And, and he's recognizing that there is something that fuels the fire of the raging hawk, and it's his anger. I read a little story in an illustration book, and uh, a Native American grandfather was talking to his grandson, and he told him a story about two wolves that fought all throughout the night. They were equally matched in power and in strength and agility and speed, and they fought all throughout the night, and the little boy was so you know, eager during the story, and he had asked, he says, well, granddaddy, who won? And he says, whichever one you feed the most. When we come to a point where we are trying to grow in Christ, we always recognize that we have this battle going on within. And many of us will be on the losing end of this battle if we feed our flesh. Feed our flesh? What are you talking about? Well, there are certain things that feed your spirit and there are certain things that feed your flesh. And depending on which one eats the most and has the healthy or balanced diet will rage out the most. And so if I'm on a steady diet of getting into the word and praying and focusing on the Lord and trying to put myself in the right places at the right times to do the right things, then then my spirit will flourish. But if I'm trying to get rid of the old man, but I'm still eating the old ways and still feeding on the wrong things and and feasting my eyes, seeing the wrong things and, and those different things. And of course, my flesh will become stronger than ever and I'll find myself on the losing end. I'll find myself like the hawk being run over by myself. I encourage you to do this, to feed your spirit, to feed your spirit every day, just like how you like to eat every day, every day. Try to read a scripture, try to read a few scriptures, meditate on God's word, pray, and then just soak up what God is saying to you. And little will you know that your spirit will begin to eat and it'll begin to grow strong and then you'll be able to control the hawk within you. Hey, I want you to come back tomorrow night or tomorrow morning or tomorrow afternoon because we will finish up our series on the Incredible Hawk. It'll be part three. Heaven's Live Video Devotional. Donald Rose signing out.